Hello and welcome to the JZ stream. I'm your host, Sean Brayford. Uh, today we're going to be playing some uh, modern Vincer ETB triggers. The uh, foundation of the deck is uh, Vincer, the Sojourner, <clears throat> says, uh, starting uh, three colorless, one white, one blue mana, starting loyalty three, plus two, exile target permanent you own, return it to the battlefield under your control at the beginning of the next end step, or minus one, creatures can't be blocked this turn. You can minus eight for an emblem whenever you cast a spell exile target permanent. Also, a, a Vincer Shaper Zaman will be one of the tools. Um, we're going to use a lot of Enter the ba Battlefield trigger <clears throat> uh, creatures like Vendillion Click, um, Thrag Tusk, Wall of Omens, etc. It's also got a, it's also con a control, control elements, some remands, Snapcasters, Handy. Uh, serum visions, uh, dispels, condescends, a little bit of everything. Which may or may not be good, we'll see. Today, uh, saw this planeswalker, wanted to do a build around it. Definitely not one of the main archetypes in modern. Drag the ideal um, draws Thrag Tusk and Vincer. Uh, when Thragtos enters the battlefield, you gain 5 life. When it leaves the battlefield, put a 3-3 green beast creature token on the battlefield. So, blink it. <clears throat> gain another 5. Put a 3-3 green beast token on the battlefield and return Thragtos back. Testing, testing. Just doing some Twitch uh, adjustments here. What else do we need to add? Some uh, add, picked up some more cards. You need to add them to this deck here, and then we need to trim some stuff down. One misty rainforest to go. We have four flooded strand, four windswept heath. One Glen Alindra Archmage. You could fly three on uh, three colorless, one blue flying. <clears throat> Pay one blue, sacrifice it. Counter target non creature spell. So this could be a good card. Maybe it's just a sideboard card, but I'm going to put it in the main for now. Um, but with the vent with uh, Vincer, we can blink it and uh, take the persist counter off. So pretty much unlimited countering of target non creature spells. Now we got to do some cuts.
Kind of heavy on five drops. Take out one. Uh, ace. I don't know what chase. I have to make some cuts somewhere. We still only have 20 land. Hey, Tie-Dye Gamer. How's it going? Uh, pretty good. Just uh, working on a new deck here. I haven't been online in a while. Um, playing or streaming or anything. Um, I did play, uh, I think you saw me play some Civilization V. But uh, right now I'm working on a new Vincer, uh, Sojourner, Enter the Battlefield trigger deck. <clears throat> Got a pretty even split between blue. A lot, of, a lot of few double blue mana cards. Just trying to figure out lands here. Only one double, uh, two double green cards. So I'm going to add two basic islands. One basic forest. We gotta make a lot of cuts here. If you need to run light on a color, run green light. I'm not sure I'm not sure what you mean by that. Run green light, so like not very many green car green uh green um yeah, one thing I have uh I have a few utopia sprawls which have to enchant a forest. It's something to keep in mind. I'm not running any um green co uh combo with white or blue um yeah. It's kind of spread out here. It's kind of hard to get all on one screen. Let's see here. Two breeding pool. Celestial colonnade. I have some uh, kind of helper lands. Four flooded strand. One Gavity township. Two ghost corridor. That might be pushing it for a three color deck like this. One glacial fortress. One hollowed fountain. One mystery rainforest. One plains. Two Island, one Forest. Three Temple Garden, four Windswept Heath. Part of it is based on <clears throat> um, budget, which is what I have. That's why I only have one Misty Rainforest, for example. Um, 
So yeah, I, I didn't have many car, many cut land cards in the bl in the green blue. I had a white and green covered because I have a, a Boggles deck that I this really greedy mana base. But right now I need a Ghost Quarter just to uh, you know the random um, you know against uh, Tron and um, random pesky lands like Raging Ravines. Uh, opponents, Gavity Townships. Uh, I might be trying to do too much with the Ghost Quarters and, and other stuff in this deck. Kind of jammed in some cards that I just happen to like and that are in the colors that I've never played with before, like Prophet of Crufix. I don't know about that one. I kind of like that you can, um, you know, you can play it and then leave up counter magic <clears throat> and and cast creatures as though they had flash, um, but it's kind of expensive. <clears throat> Are you saying don't run the ghost quarters? Seedborn Muse. Oh yeah, I could have just used a... I wonder if MTG bot is here. Um... Alright, we'll take out the Ghost Quarters. Seedborn Muse seems like, pro I mean, Prophet of Kubrick seems slightly better than Seedborn Muse. It's just blue. I mean, you have to pay a blue and green instead of double green, but um, you also get to cast creatures so that they had flash. I guess Prophet dies to bolt, but... <clears throat> okay, Ghost Quarters is going to be pushing it. We'll take those out. I'll take out a Condescend. I'm going to take out a Remand. Serum Visions probably isn't great. Taking out um, Life from the Loam, then. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got just a...